Hello everyone, I'm Marco Martin and I'm Alejandro Sardinas and, and welcome, welcome to Biotic Forensics. Forensics. In today's episode, we will be diving into a very important topic. What is forensic science? That's right. We've been proudly calling ourselves a forensic science program for four years, but believe it or not, some people don't even know what forensics actually means. Abratic, when we say forensics, we're talking about science, a lot of it. Specifically, our program focuses on the scientific aspect of forensics. This means we do not touch on topics like law enforcement or social sciences. There are several areas under the umbrella of forensics that we actually don't cover. Like forensic psychology, and forensic psychiatry, forensic accounting, and even cyber forensics. This one especially because it's so difficult that simply finding it for high schoolers will be a challenge. Actually, you want to know something cool? What? Forensics just means applying a certain principle to solve a crime. So forensic accounting is like applying accounting to solve a crime. And forensic psychology is applying psychology to solve a crime. But here, we prefer to stick to the hard sciences like chemistry when we're working on toxicology or biology when we're analyzing DNA evidence and even physics when we analyze blood spatter. These sciences are a perfect fit for forensic investigations because they align perfectly with the scientific method, which means that the results that we gather from these investigations are reliable, credible, and reproducible. Exactly what we need in court. Plus, these can be peer-reviewed. That's a big deal because it boosts the validity of the conclusions we draw from our investigation. So you can only imagine there's a lot going on in the crime lab, especially because you have a lot of people working on at the same time in multiple things. But it's not just about having enough people. It's about having the right professionals who specialize in particular fields since forensics just covers such a broad spectrum. This has resulted in the crime lab being divided into multiple sections, but we will tell you about that in another episode. Well, now you know what forensic science is all about. So next time you get asked what are you doing in forensics class, you can dive into a 10 minute explanation that ranges from law enforcement to social sciences. To uh, no, no, no. Or you could just simply tell them it's a chaotic science because we have a little bit of everything going on. That will be all for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you can see our upcoming videos. Bye. Bye. social sciences, to hard sciences, to, to just, or you could just simply tell them it's a chaotic science because we have a little bit of gold. <laughs> oh.